SI Instruments supplies high quality force and torque measurement equipment. We supply the wine industry, automotive, packaging, food industry, pharmaceutical, plastics, occupational health and safety, research and development and many others. The McMesson Advanced Force Gauge is the top of the range force gauge from McMesson. Its accurate and robust load cell has many programmable options and also has the capability to connect to external sensors. The main features of the advanced force gauge include peak hold capture in both tension and compression direction, conversion of units to newton, kilonewton, kilogram, gram, pound or ounce, a transmission of data via RS-232 and USB output. The McMesson Advanced Force Gauge has aluminium housing, is supplied with hook and compression plate, rechargeable batteries, operating manual and a certificate of calibration. The McMesson Advanced Force Gauge also has many advanced programmable features. When testing electrical switches, the peak force is not always the same force as when the switch is making or breaking contact. With the freeze reading feature, the gauge can be connected to the switch and will freeze the reading on the display when the switch makes or breaks electrical contact. When the peak reading is viewed on the display, both the peak as well as the contact force point can be displayed on the same screen. Usually used with compression testing, when testing the closing force of a door, a latch, lever or button, the initial peak force is often followed by the test coming to a dead stop. Either the door is closed and you are pushing against a closed door, or the button has been activated and has bottomed out. When set, the gauge will capture the first peak of the measurement and displays this on the screen. When the McMesson Advanced Force Gauge is used in conjunction with the McMesson Multitest D test stand, the gauge can travel between the limit switches. However, it is also possible for the Advanced Force Gauge to signal the stand when the test has been completed. This feature is a perfect time-saving operation. The feedback can be either by detecting a break or collapse point or at a pre-programmed force. In this example, we are testing the top load of a plastic bottle with the use of the McMesson Multitest 2.5D. The gauge is connected via the output to the test stand for the feedback signal. To set up the gauge, first select the menu, then go to Stand Control and select either Reverse, Stop or Cycle. In this case, we've chosen Reverse and for the test direction, we've chosen Down. The reversing criterion, either break or limit, is in this example break. The sensitivity of the break is set to 5%. Then we press escape to return to normal operating mode. The gauge starts pushing onto the bottle. The bottle has a first point of collapse and immediately the gauge will travel back to starting position. The McMesson Advanced Force Gauge is also fitted with an input connector for external force and torque transducers. Here we have a McMesson torque screwdriver 10 Newton meter. All we need to do is connect the torque screwdriver to the input connector and turn the gauge on. The gauge will recognise the transducer and its capacity during startup and adopt the correct calibration settings. There is no need for telling the electronics what is connected, with the unit now immediately ready for action. As you can see, the communication port is still fully exposed. This means that all communication features with the unit are still possible even with the external transducer connected. Whilst the external transducer is connected, the internal load cell is not in use. Please refer to the PDF brochure of the McMesson Advanced Force Gauge for a complete overview of all possible force and torque sensors that can be connected. The PDF manual that is in the download centre of our website shows all features in detail. You can also refer to instructions. Please contact our office. For further information, 